Let's blast the joint. We smoke that push, that 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 push, that 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 push, that 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 push. As the image of the supreme reality behind this universe. Imagine it's the representative of the octopus, the spider, the awful one. The creepy crawlies at the end of the line, which we're all terrified of. Now that's a very important image. Because, let us suppose, just for the sake of argument, that all of you sitting here right now are feeling uh, fairly all right. I mean, you're not in hospital. You're not, you don't have the screaming memes. You have a sense, you probably had dinner and are feeling pretty good. But you know that you feel that you're fairly good because in the background of your mind, very far off in the background of your mind, you've got the sensation of something absolutely ghastly that simply mustn't happen. And so against that, which is not happening, and which doesn't necessarily have to happen, by comparison with that, you feel pretty all right. And that absolutely ghastly that mustn't happen at all is coming. And therefore, at once, we begin to wonder whether the presence of this Kali is not in a way very beneficent. I mean, how, how would you know that things were good unless there was something that wasn't good at all? Now this is, I'm not putting this forward as a final position. I'm only putting it forward as a variation as a way of beginning to look at a problem and getting our minds out of their normal ruts. She's black. Well, she, first of all, feminine, represents what is called philosophically the negative principle. Now, of course, people who are women in our culture today and believe in women's lives don't like to be associated with the negative because the negative has acquired very bad competition. We say accentuate the positive. Well, that's a purely male chauvinistic attitude. How do we know that you are not standing? Unless, by contrast, there is something in standing. <laughs> you cannot appreciate the convex without the concave. You cannot appreciate the firm without the yielding. And therefore, the so-called negativity of the feminine principle is obviously life-giving and very important. But we live in a culture which doesn't notice it. You see a painting, a drawing of a bird and you don't notice the white paper underneath it. You see pr a printed book, and you think that what is important is the printing, and the page doesn't matter. And yet, if you reconsider the whole thing, how could there be visible printing without the page underlying it? What is called substance, that which stands underneath, sub, underneath, stands, stands. To be substantial is to be underlying, to be the support, to be the foundation of the world. And of course, this is the great function of the world. To be the substance. And therefore, the feminine is represented by space, which is of course black at night. But were it not for black and empty space, there would be no possibility whatsoever of seeing the stars. Stars shine out of space, and astronomers, high-powered astronomers, are beginning to realize that stars are a function. Now that's difficult for our common sense, because we think that space is simply inert nothing. And we don't realize that space is 
completely basic to everything. It's like your consciousness. Nobody can imagine what consciousness is. It's the most elusive, whatever it is, that there is at all. Because it's the background of... We smoke that good, that 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 good, that 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 good, 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 that that